Hello everybody, it's Sasan19 and welcome back to Mountain Blade 2 Bannerlord in the general campaign. So, a couple quick things to go through. Um, somebody talked about how the early game was really good and when you get late game it's just a bunch of grind and uh, I do completely agree with him and that got me to thinking that I wanted to remind people what this is about. Uh, this is not about taking over the world, even though we probably will do it. This is about testing a full intelligence build character. We want to know when we max this out, how good are we going to be? The great bonuses that we're going to get from when we get um, 275 there, all the bonuses we're going to get here and how our guys aren't going to die as much and they're going to come back so fast, and how fast we can actually build things. So it's not about being a 1500 day game, because we need time to build those up to see how effective they truly are. Also, I wanted to deal with my little brother from the last episode. Um, he was trapped in Cyrenia when the Empire took over it from the Kuzites, and he would not escape. 90 days went by, he did not escape. So I ended up um, leaving the Kuzites, and I attacked one of the Empire cities or villages so I could go to war with them. So they declared war on my clan, I paid for peace, and then 10 seconds later they declared war. So I paid again, and 10 seconds later they declared war, and I think you know where this is going. A never ending loop. So I had to end up backing it up to get him, because uh, I just couldn't get him out of there. So I ended up finding there was actually a save game file that was only five days earlier, which nothing had happened. It was when I was back down here. So all I did was just leave the Kuzites and walk up here. And by the time I got up here, it was basically time to grab him. So lost virtually no time. So what we're going to do, because this is a long based game, we want to try to help out the kingdom so we have as many as possible. So we're going to go join the Northern Empire. That is what we are going to do. So, who is the leader? Um, so you are the leader. Wasn't it like that Lucian or is he the Southern? I don't know. Uh, Diathema. So let's head on over to Diathema. And we're going to go join them. Um, this has taken a little bit longer because I've had to pour four points into leadership just to get up to disciplinary as quick as possible because I don't have the social points into it that I have. Normally by this time I would have, you know, seven or eight social points into there where you multiply six times 14 and all of a sudden you're coming up with almost 100 points. So it makes a huge difference. So... Let us get over here. Alright. Hello. Are they starving? They look like starving. Where did he go? Epi. They look, they're, where are they going? They gotta be going to Sinopa. to enter your service, da 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 da, yeah, yeah, alright, so, next up, immediately, create an army, get my two guys going, and now I want to go follow them, because as you can see, they're losing men, I know they're heading to Sinopa, Whoa. 
Whoa! Hello! I just kind of want to get involved in it. I got her. Uh, that was to the mount. 72 damage to the mount. Uh, I just wanted to help them out so I could get some kills, some relation, renown going, influence, I mean just everything. with him. That's pretty cool. 76 prisoners. Uh, man, I can only get two guys. As you can see, I'm not really set up for prisoners. And of course, like most of you know, the first thing that I am touching are Imperial. That's just how I roll. We look for Imperials, and we look for Cav. Alright, I am good with that. Get us some more. Pull another charger. I hate it when that happens. Since we went to war, I can't see where my guys are at. I have no clue where they're at. If they're close, if they're getting attacked, they're going to be getting attacked. I I don't know anything. I 
knife trap. Wait a minute. Oh yeah, we want to go after them. Oh yeah. Skill. What are you guys running to? Skill. I wanted to try to get as many points, and now you are free to go. We will start building our charm. Now you go bye bye. I don't even really need to go in for this one. It's just like sending the troops. Attack! So, I mean, that's what this is going to be about. It's going to be a lot of warring, is what this series is going to be about. We got a war like crazy. So I can go gain skills. So I can max them out. And then I got to shift away a little bit. Because I got to make sure that I don't get knocked out in a battle. Because then you don't gain skill. So I have to stay alive in battles. Very important. captured you. You are free to go. Equites. There you guys are. Alright. Now I can start gaining some. Now I can start gaining that leadership. Once I get some influence, then I can pack some more on. I don't think I can get to you. I'm not going to worry about him. I can't get to him. Hey, buddy. Uh, I think I am too slow to get to you. Yeah, I am way too slow. Oh, but you just trapped yourself like an idiot, didn't you? Didn't you? 
Of that piece. Yeah. I want to get him before this. Or is he completely trapped? Yeah. He's like trapped in a corner. There's nothing he can do. I want to give my archers some work. So, yeah. Um, really, this is what this series is going to be. A lot of battles, you know, a lot of sieges, possibly moving to different empires. It's really what this is going to be about. Goodbye. And see ya. Alright, let's get set up, dudes. Let's see if we can take some pop shots at. Oh, hello, Dal. I wish you could build one without thrust, that was really good, but unfortunately. We lost one man. Haha. <laughs> Damn, she was gonna take him prisoner. I lost one, so that means I bring up one. Which, of course, we are preparing these fellers. As you can see, we already have them ready to go to Fion. Oh, and I can't remember who gave me the advice. Um, I did take your advice, and I made sure I got everybody javelins. Um, I didn't do it in this playthrough. It was suggested on another one just because she uh, was already set up with a bow. But on the other playthrough, I'm going to get it done. Um, definitely made the suggestions to start putting that on there. Um, unfortunately, that was a very bad move on his part. Um, if he would have given me more time, I could have actually done more for him. However, he is an idiot. So, unfortunately, that means we're not at war. That was uh, very stupid. And I don't want, I am, I gotta be careful on food. I used to use my food to feed people. However, with the herd penalty, that is something you have to be very careful with. Um, I am overloaded a little bit, but I do not have a herd penalty. So I got that taken care of right now. 25? Jeez, I don't, I don't even have 25 yet. Alright, um... Increase maximum track width by 20% when following a hostile party on the campaign map. There, this is the 2% speed one. Yeah, this is the one that's kind of, uh eh. 2% ain't much, because 2% 2 per, 2 of 3.6, that's what, uh, 0 0.06? 0 0.06. So instead of going 3.42, I'll go 3.48. Oh yeah, that's gonna help. Unfortunately, this is gonna take a while, and because one, I don't have as much into it as I normally do, and two, I only have about 400 troops. Where before I would have so much into it, I'd be uh, cap hard capped at like 250 right now. I mean, right now I'm hard capped about one. 170. 
And if I had more influence, I could actually get more people in there. Now, unfortunately, we didn't get enough time to battle. So that really does suck. Uh, we're kind of sitting here with like, um, okay, what the heck are we going to do? And this is the really bad part about this whole thing. It's like, what do you do? I don't want to let my guys go. Because I want to get the leadership. I got to get 125. All right, uh, this is the plus. I think we go plus three, tier one and two troops. That gets to, because once they get to tier three, they can fight okay. I really think it's raised the meek. I only think that's the way to go. Let's check people's skills. Alright, everybody doing okay? Alright. Yeah, unfortunately, I'm sorry guys, they peaced out really quick. So, that kind of puts a little damper on what we are doing. We gotta wait for somebody to declare war on us, or we declare war on them. So that's uh, pretty damn sad right now. I start to get to the point where I don't know if I should just pause it until somebody actually does declare war. Since I don't know how long it's gonna take. Boy, it's going slow. 28. Wow, 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 wow. I'm only gaining two a day. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure really what else to do. You know, I'm kind of a little bit stuck right here. As you can see, they're all quite expensive. All these guys are in the teens. So, pulling more people would help. However, I really don't have the renown. Or the influence. All of them, I think. I'm really thinking that's what I should do. Because I should just go ahead and pause it. And wait for somebody to attack. How long is it going to be? I, that's why I don't know. That I wouldn't mind doing. But I have a fear. I, I mean, most likely it's going to be there. But it can be up here. So that is a fear of mine. Yeah, I'm really thinking that's what I'm going to have to do. Is pause it. Or else it's just going to take too long and... There's nothing else that I really want to do. I want to fight. Obviously, joining as a mercenary would be the smarter move to fight. However, I did want to gain leadership also. You know, the sooner I can get to 125, the better. And then that way I can go ahead and convert them all to peons. So, I think... We're, they're out of food here. I better move. They got no food. <laughs> We've taken it all. So I'm kind of thinking the better route is to pause, wait for a, a battle to come, and then that way you, at least you get a little more action. Uh, I'd like to finish off the episode with some action, so that's what I'm going to go ahead and do. I'm going to go ahead and pause it and then wait for somebody to declare war on us, and then that way we can get into a little bit more action and it's not so kind of dead. So hopefully I will see you guys real soon. Alright, so I've been waiting here probably 
30 to 50 days and still nothing. I just don't want to go to war. Uh, I have jumped my leadership up to 78, so that's going really good. We're only about, what, 42 off? So, that's the good news. But, they just, they just don't want to go to war. I mean, just sitting here waiting, 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 and nothing. Well, I won't get pregnant. I added a second person in, and I'm making just a little bit more uh, influence than I actually spend with two people in the group just to help me out. Thought about going to a third just to get it going a little bit more. Of course, you'd have to have somebody cheap. And right now, nobody is cheap. Oh, I really don't want to do that. If he was closer to 15, I might do it. But he's not. Um, I was at 93 when I started, so... You know, I've, here I went up to 100%. I'm already up to 110, so... I'm still slowly gaining. But, yeah, that's just a bit too much. So, I figure... Uh, we'll go ahead and end the episode here. And then that way I can start a fresh episode. When I do get attacked. Uh, hopefully it won't take me long to wait to get attacked or something like that and we can get going, but um, I don't really want to get attacked and then have just a little part of the episode going, so um, I think it's pretty good just to go ahead and call it here. So I will see you in the next episode when hopefully we are at war. Until then, take care and thanks for watching.